everyone i am dr ankita goel reproductive medicine specialist at viva fertility today i will be talking to you about navigation of infertility treatment so first thing is when a couple comes to a infertility clinic so what is done the first step is we take a thorough history uh, the history is taken where we ask the menstrual history the sexual history the medical history surgical history and any treatment which has been taken till now so after the history has been taken the couple is asked to do some test it can be blood test it can be some ultrasound or it can be a semen analysis also the patient can be asked to do some special test depending upon their history all this history taking and investigation are aimed to find the problem which is causing infertility in the couple so how does the couple select a infertility clinic the couple should select an, an infertility clinic which follows professional ethics which provides clarity about medical and financial aspects now what is the medical aspect see infertility has many causes a couple can have infertility because of lack of follicle formation that is a female may not be developing the follicle or in uh, simple term agar ek female ka anda nahi ban raha hai aur wo nahi phoot raha hai to she will not be able to conceive okay or other factor can be she might her tube may be blocked or may not be functional theek hai to fallopian tube is the passage between the ovaries and the uterus so if that is blocked a couple cannot conceive naturally okay the third problem can be the semen analysis of the husband may not be very good or the count may be low the motility may be low or the patient may have abnormal sperm okay so that can also cause infertility then there can also be a couple may be having thin endometrium where the lining of the uterus is not good so that can also not result in pregnancy so first thing is a clinic which provides transparency about what is your problem what treatment they are going to offer you so whenever you find that yes you understand your problem first see it is not always in vitro fertilization or ivf it is not the solution to all the infertility problem there are many things which can be done for the infertility treatment see first thing is the ovulation induction that is we just give oral medicines to the patient which help in formation of follicles that is in a simple term anda banne ki jo goliyan hoti hai wo bhi khila ke agar mahila try karengi to ho sakta hai unka conception ho jaye second thing is when a couple is not able to have intercourse properly or maybe the semen analysis count motility is on a lower side then the couple may be benefited by a another procedure that is called as intrauterine insemination okay so that is one of the sim most simple thing which can be done to achieve pregnancy so ivf is actually a last resort which has very clear cut indications where the tubes are you know damaged or blocked completely or when the semen analysis is very poor the count is very poor the motility is very poor in such condition only in, in ivf is to be considered as the first step so any clinic now coming back to this uh, topic like how do you select the clinic any clinic which tells you clearly that yes this is your diagnosis this is the treatment which i am offering you you should go ahead with that clinic okay which tells you which explains you everything and which also gives you clarity about the financial aspects of the inf uh, infertility treatment now let's talk about what should a couple expect from the infertility treatment journey see the treatment of infertility can be a roller coaster ride you have to understand your problem you have to understand the failure and success rate of the treatment offered a patient a couple might have to undergo multiple cycles of ovulation induction might have to go under multiple cycles of iui also sometimes multiple cycles of ivf see it entirely depends upon your history your your case it is different for every patient so first understand the problem have faith in your doctor the treatment they are telling you the guidance you are getting and uh, then just be optimistic because see ultimately the aim of the doctor is also to give you a healthy life pregnancy 
but it can be emotionally and financially draining. Please subscribe to this channel. Uh, there are many informative videos which will clarify your doubts on IVF. In case there are other doubts for which you don't find answers, please ask us in the comment section. I will like to answer your question. Uh, I hope I was able to uh, help you with this video uh, and if it help you kindly like it and share it so that it can reach other couples also who are confused about IVF. Thank you.